Hi everyone. Here I am going to tell you some tricks about max. Today's topic is how to find prime numbers within just 15 seconds. Let us go to our topic. I have written 1 to 100 numbers into rows of 6. Let us start to find prime numbers. 1. 1 is not a prime number and it is not a composite number as well. Now we start with 2. I have circled 2 because 2 is a prime number. We strike of all these numbers in this column because all these numbers are even numbers and divisible by 2. Similarly, 4 is divisible by 2. So, we strike off all these numbers which occurs in this column as well. Similarly, 6. 6 is divisible by 2. We strike off all these numbers in this column also. So, we are left with 3 columns. Now, all these prime numbers are going to exist in these 3 columns only. So, that solves half of the problem. Now, going to the next number 3. 3 is prime number. Under this 3, in this column you find all numbers which are multiple by 3. So, they cannot be prime number divisible by 3. So, I have striked all these numbers in this column except 3. Because 3 is a prime number. Now, going to 5. Finding number 5. 5 is a divisible. 5 is divisible by 5. See, you have to move diagonally. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100. So, I have strike off all the numbers which are divisible by 5 as well. So, now last step. 6 is already over. We move on 7 again. Find the multiples of 7 diagonally. 7, 14, 21, 28, 35, 42. 49, 56, 63, 70, 77, 84, 91 and 98. This is how we arrive at prime numbers. All numbers which are encircled and all numbers which are remaining, these are 25 prime numbers between 1 and 100. Isn't it simple? One question which I arise is why I stopped at 7 and why didn't I move for next see as I taken up to 100 as I taken up to 100 the highest number is 100 and the square root of 100 is 10 so you just need to consider below 10 so, 8 and 9 are not a prime numbers. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe and like the video.